processor has launched one of the most innovative waves of mobile computing. It's really enabled our industry to develop lighter, smaller, uh, more compact devices with great battery life. And, uh, and what I've got with me here today is an example of one of those types of devices. So I, he I heard you're going to give us a little sneak peek, so uh, uh, we're excited to see this. So what I have here today is a sneak peek at the world's most powerful 10-inch Windows tablet. It's powered by Windows 7 Premium, and it's running on an Intel Dual Core Atom processor. Okay. Maybe you show us a little bit about what it can do. Yeah, so it's, uh, tablets are great for entertainment. I'm going to move it over here to the dock so that we can get a, a good, good uh, camera shot of it. And uh, just to show you a little bit of what, what this uh, device can do. So we'll start by looking at this, this app that we have here that uh, will let you go through music. Um, and you can stream music from anywhere around the world. So let me go find a station from here in my, my hometown of Boston. So we're going to listen to a little country music. I guess. <laughs> Okay, so now this is wirelessly connected, right? Wirelessly connected, and uh, wireless is great for a device like this. Um, we want to be connected always on the go. And uh, WiMAX actually is a great, a great example of technology that we will be supporting a device like this with the high bandwidth needed for a rich entertainment experience. Okay. Looks like we're having some troubles with the uh, with streaming here, but let's just move move on. So another thing you can do with this is, is just check out your, your photos. Uh, so keep on set for friends and family. So we've got this connected to Facebook. So I've got all my Facebook friends here and then all the most recent photos will appear here. Okay. And then uh, I've got a long flight home. So uh, let's go check out what, uh, what movies I've got queued up for my flight. So we've got uh, uh, some movies that I previously downloaded here for the device. So we can, uh, we can play here. So this is a high definition. Um, video of the movie Up, which my daughter is just in love with right now, so uh, it's been uh, capturing so, my So this is really picking up all the capabilities and the performance from a dual-core processor like the N550. Yeah, the, the dual-core processor is perfect for a device like this because it gives you both the, the performance and the battery life that you need for uh, to provide the rich entertainment experience that you get in a, in a tablet like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let me just, uh, so your movies and, and, and photos and, and music are great, but uh, sometimes you just want to kick back and kill a few zombies, so let me go over here to this, uh, this game that's been pretty addicting to me recently. It's a bit common thing. <laughs> so some of you guys may recognize this, uh, the Plants vs. Zombies on some of the other tablets that are out there. It's a, a pretty popular game. It really does a, it does a good job of showing off uh, touch and what you can do mm -hmm. uh, in terms of entertainment on a device like this. So let me just show you a little bit what we've got going here. So. Hey Dave, that's great. Maybe, let's get back to work. I, <laughs> I know you like this. Um, so, so you know, great tablet kind of experience. But you know, there are also times that you know you have to do work, and maybe that's where the tablets are a little bit limited as well, though, right? Yeah, you brought up a key point. Uh, tablets are great for entertainment, but they aren't exactly conducive to productivity. So for that, they're missing one key feature, and that's a keyboard. Right. So allow me to introduce you to wow. the dual personality. Oh, nice. Del and <laughs> Del and this is a 10-inch tablet with a keyboard powered by Windows 7 Premium and running on a dual-core Atom processor. It's great for uh, providing the productivity that you need to have, as well as allowing you to kick back and relax and enjoy entertainment on your own terms. So actually, it's a good time for me to go ahead and send an email to my boss and let him know that I'm, I'm staying busy here. So, uh, so, so now that he, he knows you're working and not just playing right. games, right? Right. So, so what does what does a platform like this then mean, Dave, for developers that we have out here in our audience with us this morning? Yeah. So it's a it's a great point. So I'm hoping that a lot of you out there today, as developers, are looking at a device like this and are already coming up with some cool new ideas for for apps that you can write for a device like this. And uh, I know you're going to be wanting to get a lot more detail on, uh, on its capabilities. So rest assured, we will be providing that in the near future. So please stay tuned. So, so when will this Dell Inspiron Duo be available in the market? How so soon we get it? It'll be available later this year. OK, great. Hey, uh, so, so thanks, Dave, for uh, coming out, giving us a sneak peek at uh, this really exciting device. Thank you very much. All right, take care.